welcome to the Love and Loose Show, where I am here to give you some new information. So before I start, I want you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button, that bell notification, give it a thumbs up, comment below, of course, share this video. So I just want to tell you, so you know how, okay, one, I'm not on Facebook that often. I'm not on Instagram that often. So if you follow me, you know I'm not really on those things, but I have them. But anyway, somebody had me join this thing called Sip and Slay. So I thought Sip and Slay, we're going to be drinking some wine, some kind of alcohol, and we are slaying with our looks, our outfits, or something. You know, that's what I be thinking Slay is. So I joined, and it told me to invite, like, five people, and I tried to invite as many as I knew because I felt all of us was sipping and slaying together, right? Girl, so my one friend... The one that's always on my talking out show. She said, no, Lenora, it isn't, girl. It's about wigs. And I was like, what? Yeah, the, you know, you're showing off your wigs. That's why I was showing off my wig. I was like, shut up. You were showing off your wig. I was like, yeah. I said, I'll be wearing different wigs sometimes. You know, you guys know I love my braided wig, but I'm doing this cute one. So, anyway, we were sitting here. And we had just finished doing the talking out show. And so I said, oh, I should take a picture because I had just got it. So I said, oh, I should take a picture of her. She said, yeah. And I'm going to put it on thing. She said, yes, I got it on Sip and Slay. And then I took my little picture. <laughs> and I added one picture on it because, you know, I was thinking I was slaying the cute hair, dude, because I really like it. And I even like the color, too. I think it brightens up my skin, don't you think? So anyway, I'm, that's it. So, you know, I'm done with Facebook. I'm You know, I'm bored, and I, I, I'm done. That was fun. I'm going back to my YouTube channel and watch people's videos because that's when I get excited. I learn new things and stuff like that. So I'm watching people's videos. You know how I do it. Girl, my one friend called me on Marco Polo saying, girl, you, uh, you, girl, you can win. I thought she said, girl, you can win. This is what I thought she said. Girl, you can win, you know, because you got your ponytail. Girl, get on the live and do it. And it was like 8 o'clock. But I didn't see the Marco Polo until about 11 o'clock. And I was like, well, I just took the wig off. I don't really want to put it back on. It's not a wig. It's a ponytail. So you got to really do some work, you know. So I said, let me go on the sippers lay and look. And I'm looking. I said, let me try to listen to the live. And so um, something happened. Of course, my little guard children are running around doing whatever. And so, um, yeah, it was like because we was up late watching TV upstairs together as a family. Because that's what we did. And so, um, I just started scrolling because I forgot that I was watching a video when I was done talking to the kids. And I scrolled and said, congratulations, Queen Lenora Hall. Girl, call me, instant message me. You have 24 hours to get in contact with me for your winnings. And I was like, I won. I didn't even know I entered a contest. That's what I'm saying. I did not know I was into entering the contest. And then she's like, you met all the qualifications and stuff when I was listening. Because I ended up watching the video later. And it said I met all the qualifications. I didn't even know I was qualifying for anything. This is what's so, you know, when you're not paying attention to something. Because I don't win nothing. And literally, I wasn't even trying. That's probably why I won because I wasn't trying to win. So I don't know. She did the spinning of the wheel. And it was somebody else's name. And that's when I said, Queen Lenore. I was like, shut up. She was congratulating somebody else. And it said, my name. Flash up. That said, shut up. I won. Didn't even know. But I won a free headband wig. Human hair. And it was so funny. It's because um, after I took a picture and put myself on there uh, with me and uh, Shavante was looking for her a headband wig. And I wanted to get one. But I was like, I don't have money for this. Because, you know, I'm... I'm trying to get my money together for, you know, to cover my book, and I just paid for my grandfather's cover his book, and I'm like, okay, so now this whole week I'm going to have to really just start typing it in a different format and, and do what I got to do. But I had no freaking clue. You guys got to understand, I had no clue this was going on. So I want a free headband, and she gave me up to $100 on Amazon for this free headband wig. I didn't spend the whole hundred because I saw it was like eighty six dollars, but it was eighteen inches. So then, I, when I went to click it to put it in my uh, uh, shopping cart, um, it said, you know, you, you know where you could change the color or something like that. And so I saw, oh, it says sixteen inches because I'm not really with the long, long hair. You know, my 
braided one is fine because it doesn't get tangled in the back or anything. So I was like, I want to get the 16 inch. And so that ended up being $68 and I got free band. And then she said, girl, you're going to get it on Monday. I said, the Lord loves me. So me and Shavante might get our wigs at the same time. We might be twin sisters. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Because I got one that's similar to hers because I liked it so much. I was like, girl, you got to get this one. This is my favorite one right here. I don't want the wet and, wide, wet and wavy. I want this one. This right. This girl. She's like, okay, girl, I want it too. So I'm just saying the Lord be blessing you don't even know. Like I wasn't even trying. I was on sip and sweat. But then you know what did give me an idea, you guys? So I was thinking I might do something that I really like on here. And when I hit my 600 or my 1,000, because my 1,000, I'm doing money. That's just it. So while when I get my 600, if I get my 600, I might do something I really like. And you could do it on uh, Amazon. But I love you guys. Now, who are you supposed to be checking out? You're supposed to be checking out Sci-Fi First, a movie talk, because he is the bomb. He's very animated. He's awesome. He talks about good things. And again, he be doing collabs, which is awesome. I'm just, <laughs> I feel like because I'm not really a movie, movie person. Like, I like movies, but I like only, like, certain type of movies. And he likes all types of movies that I never really want to include. And he was going to have me in the horror one. Uh, he told me I could do it, and I didn't. I, and now I regret it. Uh, but he's awesome. I love him. Love him, love him, love him, love him. And then sometimes he has his kid on there. His kid's so cute. And they be doing stuff together. So it's an awesome thing. And his wife is doing things, like doing the editing. I, it's a family affair. And I love anything if you guys are working with your family. I just love it. Okay, with Mom27, no break. She got, you going to see her vlogging with her family and her kids. And they're just a beautiful family. And she has such a beautiful spirit. I just love her spirit. So, of course, check her out. And then Mother Consultant. That's my girl, Shavante, and we're on Talking Out Show. And if you hear our names, of Lydia, Joanna came from a play that we did called Who's Fun Who when we first started the radio station. And that's how we had it on the radio station because it was a little sitcom. And if you check out Spreaker podcast for slash Talking Out Show, you'll also see that... Um, the who's full of who that we were doing there's a one skit i put it on there so you can see what we're talking about but that said i'm trying to slowly just get us to not be lydia and joanne but then you know what i kind of got so used to lydia and joanne i don't even want to change it anyway i hope this helped you guys now i see the person's name that i wanted to put on there and i feel so bad so but uh, that person will be the first person I put on my next one because I I enjoy this person. This person also is um, always watches my show and gives me comments and stuff like that. I'm always into the people that are watching my show and give me comments and stuff like that. And they are constantly on my channel. I'm going to give those people shout outs because I love them. Because they're constantly talking to me and um, giving me cute, cool feedbacks and stuff like that. And I just enjoy that. And I want to make sure they get people looking at their channels so i would like all you guys to go to theirs it should be in the description so the description and of course you guys seeing their channels anyway i love you guys so much please don't forget to subscribe if you're not a follower if you haven't already subscribed hit that bell notification so you'll know when i pop up you want to give me a thumbs up because you love me and i love you and you want to comment below because i need to hear from you i need to talk to you i need to have conversations with you and most of all share my video to the world so I can get more subscribers because I love you guys, huh? Nah, just saying, just share me because I'm awesome. And you want to see me again? Yeah. Okay, because that's how we do it. Oh, I'm just joking. And don't forget to remember to love and live each day as if it were your last. Smooches.